Hello and welcome to the lecture on string positions. In this example, we'll try to find the string position of a given word in a string. Okay, let's do an example five. So logical flow is to find the string position inside a string. It's a very common scenario when you work with strings. You want to find some strings inside a string. So part of this, we will create string position dot php file. So let's quickly create this. So I'm going to write a big content. So I'll say content. This is a very long content and it is a string. And what we're going to do here, we're going to find the string position inside this. So we'll say this is the find content word which will say okay we want to find content inside the content variable okay we can actually do a position variable and figure that out and the method that we can use is string strpus this is the method strpus to find the position inside a string so the first parameter is your content the second parameter is the word that you're finding okay then it will find the position so let's print the position okay so let's print the position first okay so that's the 20th position in the string and it's able to find this content inside this string okay and if you are doing a content like this okay and you want to find it out obviously it cannot find out because the content is different case you can use stri pos it is case insensitive and is able to find it out okay the i indicates it is an insensitive case insensitive search okay so let's say you want to find find content word is nothing but content one okay then we'll say position find this out and we will try to find a position which is not available right this content one is not available so you see it is empty it's false right and i want to show you how the false look like right to understand this concept very clearly if you print true false let's say i print true again so you see the difference okay so let's run our program php string position so you have to understand how the false is being printed okay false doesn't really print a zero value okay it doesn't have an integer value it has an empty space it's not a space but it's empty right so when you print false it is empty okay similarly how you print the position here it is empty it is basically false it's not zero it is false okay so if you want to compare position you actually compare it with false like this this is the best way to compare and this is the right right way to compare the position okay and then you can say echo not found okay then you can say it's not found the string is this string is not found in this string okay and let's say you want to understand the position how it works so if let's say i want to print i want to find this okay and if you print the position the position is actually zeroth position because it's starting from zero right and zero is not false remember this a false is false here right and we know how to compare that false so never compare it with zero because zero could be the zeroth position and it is actually a true condition means the string has been found 
okay so you have to be careful with string positions okay string positions of zero it means it's not false it's actually true this the string has been found okay so if you say if not position then you can say dollar position so I'm just trying to show you how it can be checked if you do this typically it's saying not found okay the zeroth value but this is a wrong condition right you should not check like this you should not say not of dollar position you should not do this okay nor you should because if you what you are doing it here is you are doing this right you are trying to check the false condition here and it will not work in the if okay it's wrong you should always check this one this is the right way to check whether the position is correct or not okay so obviously it's false condition right it doesn't print it because position is found that's why you should always check it with false not with zero means you should not do if of not position found because typically sometimes you think oh zero means false actually zero is not false the zero could be zeroth position of that value so the right way to check is check with the false remember to use three equal to to check the data type as well okay the value and the data type has to be false okay never ever check with if of zero okay if of zero could be false but that is a wrong way of checking okay i hope this concept is very clear when you're using string positions string position output is false then the string is not found if the string position output is zero means it is found okay so be careful with this when you do this kind of searches many of the people make this mistakes of understanding string position zeroth position is false okay zeroth position is not false zeroth position is actually the starting position of that string okay so i hope it's very clear how to work with string positions if you want to compare case insensitive you use i okay if you want to use case sensitive then remove that i okay so that's on the lecture on string position and i'll see you in the next one